Hello traders, welcome to Simple Trading Style and today we are going to talk about daily stock market update and we will figure out is it still bearish trend or it's a bullish reversal signal what's going on with the stock market world on a daily time frame. As usually, as usual, as usually please follow five rules of risk management, read it and follow it every single trade and you will be successful. Now it's a time for VBull. VBull, let's start index chart definitely. It started from negative and it did move positive all day. It was nice bounce. It was nice bounce. Dow Jones just plus 0.25 percent. S&P 500 plus half percent, and Nasdaq plus 0.80 percent. It was one percent even more positive today. Now let's move to my watch list, and we will do technical analysis review. Let's start from USA dollar, right? USA dollar DXY. If you want to learn more about uh, Vbull setup, just go to the description. There is the link about Vbull setup training and other links about all my trainings. Let me briefly mention about my setup. I'm using moving averages white line MA200, purple line MA100, this is purple line MA100, blue line MA50, Yellow line MA20, red line MA10, green line MA5. MACD indicator lines, RSI indicator lines, also oscillator bars. Bullish trend, last bar still, it's a huge negative bar, minus half percent. Uh, yeah, we didn't see it for a long time, right? For several bars, for, yeah. Strong, strong red bar like this one. For last 10 bars. And finally we received, it's connected back to SMA, SMA5. Nothing happened. Still bullish trend. Still bullish trend on all indicators. And it is bearish for indexes, right? And 4 hours time frame, it did bearish reversal. And 4 hours time frame definitely confirmed bearish reversal signal already. Maybe dollar wants to go bearish. It will be bullish for equities. That's what we have. Now let's move to Q's. Q's daily time frame, green bar, still below all moving averages, still bearish trend on all indicators, nothing changed. Nothing changed. 4 hours time frame, last bar moved above MA5 and 10, but at the same time, as MA20, MA20 did bearish crossover over 200. It is very negative setup. I feel like it is bull trap. It wants to bounce, maybe it will connect to SMA 20 or 200 and it will be rejected. It's building bullish reversal at the same time. MA 20 builds bearish trend, bearish setup. One hour time frame, it did bullish reversal, did bounce because it was very oversold on RSI, it was expected and it did bounce. It did bounce nicely for last four bars, it did touched. Uh, SMA MA50 and looks like MA50 strong resistant. It was to it wants to be rejected from MA50. MA100 did bearish crossover also. Positive bullish trend on one hour time frame. VXN minus volatility index for Nasdaq minus three and a half percent. Red bar still bullish trend on daily time frame. Or we extend it is negative for for Q's S and P five hundred SPX plus zero point sixty percent still last bar below all moving averages still bearish trend still bearish trend on daily time frame four hours time frame last bar moved above MA five stopped at MA ten. It is positive, but remember, same bearish setup, right? MA20 did bearish crossover. Very negative, it, did, it is disconnected from 20, definitely wants to have bounce. It was very oversold on RSI, and it did. It was looking for bounce, and it, it can be bounce. This bounce can continue up to, it can run up to 200, connected to 200 or, or 20. And will be rejected from 20 or from 200. We'll see. 
On one hour time frame, you did bullish crossover. Bullish crossover, it's weaker than Qs. It didn't touch MA50 yet. Still bullish. Still bullish on one hour time frame. VIX minus 5%. Let's see daily. VIX minus 5%. It was nice bullish crossover over 200. And it came back. Still bullish trend. It's still negative for S&P 500. DIA Dow Jones. Last three bars, they stopped at SMA 200. SMA 200 could be strong support. Maybe it will bounce from SMA 200 or it can continue bearish trend. We'll see so far. It is bearish trend at the, at the, at the 200 support level. For our time frame, last bar moved above SMA 5, above MA moving averages 5. It is positive, but at the same time, MA20 did bearish crossover. It is very, very negative. One hour time frame, MA5 and 10 did bullish crossover over 20. Nice bullish trend on one hour time frame. VXD volatility index for Dow Jones, very negative, minus 18.5%, very negative bar. And it closed below all moving averages. It is very negative. It is very negative. It means next 48 hours, 85% chance that Dow Jones will have a, it will have a red day. Maybe tomorrow, maybe after tomorrow. Now let's move to IWM. IWM Russell 2000. Russell 2000 daily time frame nice bullish run nice bullish bar it did move above MA5 yeah it's trying to do some bullish reversal as you see it has a gap it didn't close this gap maybe it wants to close this gap positive bar and negative setup same story MA20 just did bearish crossover over 200 it is bearish trend for hours time frame, MA5 did bullish crossover over 10. All indicators did bullish reversal signal. And for hours time frame, it is bullish reversal signal. The last bar touched MA20. Maybe MA20 will be rejection. Will, will it reject and will be resistant? It can reject it or it can continue bullish trend. So far, it is bullish reversal in four hours time frame. And one hour time frame also bullish reversal, bullish crossover. MA5 and 10 did over 10, 20, and 50. It is positive bullish reversal. Let's see. Few, yeah, few, few pennies before close the gap. It did almost close the gap, but it didn't fully close the gap. Still like. Yeah, 25 cents. Still 25 cents missed. Maybe it will bounce, will cl will close this gap and it will be rejected. We'll see. So far it is bullish. Apple. Let's start Apple one hour time frame. MA5 did bullish crossover over 10 and 20. Bullish signal, bullish reversal signal in one hour time frame. Four hours time frame. Last bar still below all moving averages, still bearish. Daily, last bar still below all moving averages, still bearish on all indicators. Apple still bearish. Tesla, Tesla is, was green day, very positive day today, 2.5%. For last four days, you see it, it, it dancing around SMA 100. MA 100 strong support line. Looks like it wants to bounce from it, we'll see. Will it bounce or it will continue bearish trend? For our time frame, looks like it wants to bounce from MA200 also. Last bar moved above MA5 and 10. Still disconnected from 20, but nice is building nice, nice bullish reversal. 
on one hour time frame is already did bullish crossover bullish reversal MA5 did bullish crossover over 10 and 20 at the same time MA50 did bearish crossover it is very negative setup so far on one hour time frame it, it wants to go bullish Nvidia let's start Nvidia one hour time frame MA5 and 10 and 20 did bullish crossover over 50 bullish signal on all indicators Four hours time frame, MA5 did bullish crossover over 10 and 20, last bar above MA5, 10 and 20. Bullish crossover on all indicators. And daily time frame. Daily time frame Nvidia wants to do bullish crossover also. MA5 did bullish crossover, ready for bullish crossover over 10. Looks like, yeah. As, MA100 was strong support, it couldn't break out this MA100 and looks like it wants to bounce from MA100 for NVIDIA Microsoft, let's start Microsoft Microsoft daily still bearish last bar below all moving averages, still all indicators bearish 4 hours time frame Still bearish trend on all indicators except also oscillator and one hour time frame MA5 and 10 did bullish crossover over 20 bullish reversal signal on one hour time frame Amazon same setup one hour time frame did bullish crossover over 20 4 hours time frame still bearish and daily still bearish trend for Amazon and Baba, Baba is usually on daily did bullish crossover MA5 at the same time bar, bar, last bar moved below all moving averages it is very negative, very bearish 4 hours time frame it, it did bearish reversal signal on 4 hours time frame still last bar below all moving averages 1 hour time frame yeah, still below all moving averages, still bearish. Nvidia very weak, very weak. Let's do summary. Like I said, USA dollar still positive, still bullish, it's negative for equities and indexes. All indexes, all equities on my in my watch list, they all still bearish on daily time frame, still bearish on four hours time frame. They're building some bullish reversal, but still bearish, very negative setup. MA20 ready for bearish crossover over 200 on all in indexes and all uh, equities. On one hour time frame, they all did bullish crossover, did bullish reversal signal because it was they all were very over oversold, and now we received some bullish reversal signal. That's expected. How high it will go, we will we will observe it. And remember, we follow the trend, we don't fight with the trend. This trend change direction, we have to change direction. That's, that's all. That's all. Only one hour time frame is positive bullish. Everything else still, still bearish. Now let's move to disclaimer. I'm not a financial advisor. This video for educational and informational purposes only. Remember, for educational purpose, we are using paper trading simulator as long as we need to get constantly profitable at least for six months. Thank you for watching simple trading style videos. I do publish daily, weekly, monthly updates for stocks, ETFs, indexes, and cryptos. Please subscribe to this YouTube channel, click like button to support this channel, and put your comments if you have any suggestions or any questions. Thank you so much and good luck. Bye now.